some time later, Adrian and Jolpa kiss and hug each other. They both start joking a bit too. After a while, Adrian leaves. Eva sees all this from the kitchen window. Her jealousy is visible on her face. Jolka enters the kitchen after a while, and while Eva was making the cake, she inquires as to why she despises Adrian. Eva asks her why she is asking this question. She says that it is because Adrian was asking her about you again and again. So Jolka says that when she went naked swimming, the village administrator opposed her. Then she left the naked swimming. Eva tells him that it is not a good thing to tell him such a private thing about your mother and goes to get milk to make the cake. But Eva goes the same way Adrian was going. And later, she catches him on the way and asks him to sit in the car. Adrian sees her and gets into the car without saying anything. Neither of them talks to the other for a while. Then Eva stops the car on an empty road. They both sit quietly in the car. Eva looks very upset and Adrian also looks in distress, as if she wanted to tell him so much, but she is silent. When Adrian touches the hair that comes on Eva's cheek, she gets very excited as soon as her hand touches her cheek, and they both start kissing each other, and they both kiss each other for a very long time in the car, doing body romances as if both of them wanted it. Then they both get intimate in the car. After getting intimate, Adrian goes outside the car to pee when Jolka's call comes on his phone. Seeing her phone call, Eva gets very nervous and cuts the phone call. Adrian kept looking at her through the car door. The happiness was visible on his face. Eva doesn't seem happy because of her attraction to Adrian. She would have formed an intimate relationship with him. She asks him for a cigarette because of his attraction toward her. That is why she did not want him to stay with her daughter. But today she could not control herself. She feels regret and she gets very upset. She smokes a cigarette and Adrian is watching her through the car door. Then he sits in the car, lights another cigarette and gives it to Eva and tries to kiss her again. But Eva ignores him again. And then he stops and keeps looking at her. Eva asks him to leave. He gets upset and leaves after listening to her. Eva finishes her cigarette and starts the car and leaves from there. When she brings milk near the house, then after getting down from the car, she sees that the whole decoration of the house is spoiled. When she goes inside the kitchen, she sees that Jolka has fainted there. Then Eva asks him the reason for spoiling the decorations. Then Jolka says that there will be no party. Eva gets upset after hearing this and goes close to her, and she also cries. Ask him the reason. Then Jolka weeps and says to her mother, Eva, Mom, you are right. You are always right. Adrian is not a good boy. He didn't do well with me on my birthday either because Adrian had to message her that he would not come to her anymore. And in the future, he will never meet her and break up with her. And he spoiled my birthday. She cries a lot. And later Eva hugs her and tries to console her. Eva tries to convince him, but the trouble is visible on his face. And all this happened because of him. Today, because of the daughter whose birthday she wanted to celebrate in a big way, her love is away from her, and her birthday is also spoiled. The end. Thank you for watching.